All right. There are plenty of videos out there on YouTube showing how to install ice and water, but this very may well be the first what not to do when installing ice and water. So I'm doing a quick repair here because it's got a rotted spot, water running off and rotting the soffit out. They did not overhang it over the edge metal. It's wicking back up in and rotting out. Let me show you the little damage they got down here. Got it kind of rotten out in the soffit there because it's smooth and flush and water's running out here, but Here's the important part. Here's what you don't want to do when you install ice and water. And actually, what is ice and water? Let's back up. It's this rule of stuff. It is required to be on, most manufacturers required anyways, on bottom edges up above the cross wall. I'll plug a picture card up here for you. When it melts uh, snow in the wintertime, melts because your rising heat to your attic melts it and it flows back down over your cold exterior, uh, your exterior wall over the cold section, refreeze. Ice and water is designed to stick to your bottom edge metal section and seal your nails. So if it ice dams and backs up, it doesn't leak in. <laughs> like I said, plenty of how to's. This is what not to do. Pretty costly mistake here. They did not peel the cellophane off. <laughs> really simple mistake to make. I don't know how you make it. It's on there so it doesn't stick all in the roll, but it's made to be peeled off when you install it. It will make a nice solid bond to your edge metal. In this case, it's not. This one they did. This one they didn't. You can see where it's rotten in there. So, save yourself the trouble. Watch this two minute video, know what not to do when installing ice and water. Don't forget to peel your backing off, it's really simple. If you liked the video, give me a thumbs up, comment down below. I enjoy making these videos and just would like a little comment back if you like watching them so I know to keep making them or not. If you know somebody might benefit from this video, tag them, share it with them, share it on social media, and subscribe so you are kept in the loop when I upload more how-to preventative maintenance for you, the viewer. I appreciate it. Enjoy. Have a good one.